this machine is uh, Eric Johannesson's from Riverton. Uh, this is his uh, latest edition. This is number four that's been through the through the shop. It's uh, a 1971 white gauge metal and uh, it has electric power steering in it and it has power brakes and it has air from the outside that goes into the heater so it draws outside air okay and this is how the cover locks it's keyed so it has LED lights LED lights for lifting nets. It has the rubber spring bumpers in here for a soft ride and guaranteed not to break a spring. So that makes it just smooth rider. Smooth ride and this little piece of iron here is meant for taking springs out so your bar doesn't slide down. Okay. The, uh, wanted a side door so we made them a new side door and this is the floor it's two piece uh, reinforced underneath window bars so the tubs don't smash out the windows So this is really nice, but this one is definitely a working bombardier, yes? This is a fishing bombardier. Eric was in construction for years, and he decided to do something at home, so he got into fishing. And uh, he hates junk. He was fussy when he was in construction. So this is number four. New sprockets, new tires, new tracks. Heavy duty rims. So I guess if you're going to go out in the ice, you want everything to be working perfect, not have breakdowns on the That's ice. Right. All his doors are hinged to lift off. Lift off. And this is his motor. What kind of motor is that? That's a Ford 351. Okay. And this is uh, the new style of. A fuel filter so you get away from all those small fuel filters. Okay. New rad. Bumpers forward and back. And this has just been rolled in. You can see there's there's still snow on the, the machine here. We had to pull the blue one out of the shop here just so we can get this one done and out the door. This is the original door. There, uh, it's paneled so it doesn't do any damage inside. And that's a tub stopper there. Mm -hmm. It's all insulated, spray insulated, the whole thing. And then covered with quarter inch plywood. Okay. Uh, so you don't damage the the insulation and it has two new style heaters a double fan mm -hmm. he wanted lights or uh mirrors on both sides so he can see what he's doing when he's backing up yes uh custom uh, bucket seats, uh, automatic transmission, RPM gauge, plus uh, lights and everything else on the master switch panel over there. Okay. This is the intake for his fresh air going into his heater. So the heater is not drawing any fumes out of the bombardier. Okay. Damn good.
okay. Uh, then he decided, well, we might as well put a CD player and a radio in there while we're at it. We can listen to the, some uh, local music. Smoking music. Today, and this is, uh, this is how this door works. Slammer there, it's all weatherproofed, ready to go. Okay, so this is a 1971 wide gauge. Metal. Metal. Beautiful condition. It's Johannesson Fisheries, yes? That's right. Out of Riverton. Yep. This fisherman doesn't fool around. He knows that uh, he wants good equipment out in the field and not have breakdowns because he's a busy man doing commercial fisher fishing. And uh, this is, uh, it's just been pulled into the shop for some minor repairs. And we're going to pull the blue one back in here again down the road. <laughs> 